I just watched them. My God, I actually just watched those films. I watched the entire trilogy. And I've only got one thing to say. What the hell did I just watch? Hello everyone and welcome to another brand new episode of Reese's Random Reviews. I am Reese. I'm about to give you a random review. Just a quick heads up, I do apologise for not doing many random reviews lately. I, because I'm very close to my 200th video, which is coming out in New Year's Day, I'm keeping a very strong limit on my videos. But I was lucky enough to squeeze in this random review because I had to talk about this trilogy. The VHS trilogy are three films based on a bunch of characters who find videotapes. They put them videotapes in a television or any television that they see and as they do there's all these short films that involve horror and these films are completely completely fucked up that's right i said fucked up because these films are incredibly fucked up and they're so weird like this is a very weird trilogy i mean earlier this year if you remember i saw the human centipede trilogy for the first time and i was completely shocked by how fucked up that film is. But the VHS trilogy is just as fucked up. So I'm going to review each film as I go along. But I'm going to do this kind of quickly. Also just so you know. Normally when I show images of the movies. Go along as I talk. I'm actually not going to show any images of these films. Because these films are that fucked up. That even the imagery is very fucked up. So you're just going to have to watch me talk about them. But anyway. VHS trilogy tells a story as I said. About a bunch of characters who put in videotapes. And they see all these five short films. Or there's four or three. It's normally about four or five, but there's many of them. Okay, so let's get on to the first movie. So the first film was released in 2012, and it's about a bunch of burglars who break into a house, and they're looking for a tape, a certain videotape, and then each of them, one by one, put in these tapes, and there's like five of them, and then each of them is a bunch of five short horror films, which literally make no sense whatsoever. But I tell you one thing, they're very fucked up, but not just that, they're completely like bizarre and yet it's so good now i'm not really a fan of found original films but vhs is so original and so brilliant how they made it that you just can't help but watch it but at the same time you're just like ah! Ah! what's gonna happen ah. oh it's kind of like one of them sore films it's just like that and it, at the same time you just think that was pretty good but what the hell is going on? And that is exactly what the first film was like. The first film, you you know, nothing makes sense. Nothing's it, nothing is explained. But you're watching it and you're just like, okay, okay, I've seen it. That's fine. And then, of course, we get into the second film, which is a completely different story. A detective or two detectives are looking for a missing student. And next thing you know, they start putting videotapes. And again, four short films are played. And these short films are even much more psychologically abusive to your brain there's one of them which really freaks me out the most i'm not going to spoil anything by the way so don't worry but there's this short film where a bunch of people go into like this temple or school or something in indonesia but they basically go inside this temple and when they do there's these really bunch of weird people in white clothes and they just stare at you and go like come with me come with me I want to show you something, come with me. And then they just stare at you when they're riding on their desks and they're just like... Seriously, that is exactly what the film is like. It Everything in this film is so much more bizarre than the first, but yet they're so good. Like The first and the second film of VHS are so original and so bizarre that I did actually enjoy these films. Like, they are watchable, good horror films. But at the same time, you're kind of like, do I really want to watch it again? To be honest, I do, because I do actually like these films. But then, of course, there's always a disappointment when it comes to a trilogy, unless, of course, you're watching the Bourne films or something like that. But as usual, there had to be a fuck-up in one of the films, especially when it comes to horror genres. VHS Viral, which is the third film, is completely the opposite of the first two. Because it's shit. <coughs> VHS Viral is a complete waste of time. I didn't even watch all of this film because it's so bad. The setup for this film is not even fucked up. It's just stupid. Like, VHS Viral isn't fucked up. 
It's just a complete fuck up because the whole film is terrible. VHS Viral is an awful, 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 awful horror film. It's a terrible sequel. I mean, seriously, it's worse than one of the Freddy vs. Jason sequels. It's worse than any other horror sequel I've probably seen. It's probably even worse than the Cabin Fever remake. Seriously, VHS Viral is awful. The Human Centipede 3 was even better than this. I didn't even like The Human Centipede 3. The Human Centipede 3 had a story. At least it had a bit of clever satire to it. But VHS Viral was a complete waste of time. Seriously, guys, if you're going to watch VHS, watch the first two, but avoid the third one. You might think, oh, you know, I'll just go with my own opinion. I'll watch the third film. But seriously, everyone agrees. The third film is terrible. I mean, I heard the third film was terrible, but I watched it on YouTube and I thought, you know what, maybe I'll just watch the first, like, 20 minutes and see what it's like. And then when the first 15 minutes was on, I was like, okay, let's turn that off. And I did. And my God, it was awful. VHS Viral is not worth watching. Seriously. Oh, my God. So anyway, guys, I just want to talk to you about the VHS films because I just had to say something about it. But anyway, what is your favourite VHS film? Did you even like the third film? I don't know how you could because it's shit. But seriously, tell me what you guys think about VHS. Comment below, subscribe and let me know, guys. And don't forget as well that more videos are coming up, but they're coming very limited until New Year's Day because, as I said, I'm getting very close to my 200 videos. So I'm being very careful with the number of videos that I'm putting up. And also, don't forget as well, guys, that some brand new stuff is coming up of course and uh, more random reviews are on the way and loads of videos are coming up just keep an eye out guys as always you guys are legends I can't believe that I've reached 130 subscribers I love you all you are fantastic and I am Reese, and I have just given you a very bizarre and a very fucked up random review I've said fucked up quite a lot I do apologise for my swearing but VHS is fucked up it is